Hello everyone, my name is Cécile Brochet and I'd like to talk here about rhythm, a huge topic in a few small minutes. But first of all, I'd like to warmly thank the ESTA Portugal team for the wonderful work they're doing to keep us connected and bring the conference alive. To introduce myself in a few words, I would say I am a violinist, a long-time performer and teacher. I've been trained classical in a conservatory and jazz in a jazz school. And so now I work in very diverse situations. In jazz and related, when you work with drummers, you have to be precise at the 16 note level. And not just taking the quarter note as the reference, like I was taught before at the conservatory. I give you an example. Let's take a dotted 8 and a 16 note. I take a beat and maybe I would do it so. Da, 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 da. Or maybe I would do it so. Da, 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 da. Huh. But no one is correct, right? So if I want to be precise, I would do it this way. And then you can decide if you want to phrase it a certain way, but you start with something that's precise. I give you another example. Let's take a triplet of quarter notes. Same, I take, I take my pulse, my beat. Maybe I would do it so. Da, 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 da. But it's not correct. If I want to be precise, I would. Da, ti, ti, da, ti, ti, gamma, la, gamma, la, gamma, la, gat, ki, ki, gat, ki, ki, gat, ki, ki. Da, di, di, da, di, di, da. So, not only you need to be precise with the smaller subdivisions with the drummer, but also have, of course, a sense of the wider beats and of cycles, especially if you improvise. But isn't this true no matter what kind of music you play? Some rhythm principles are common and basic to concern about, like the sense of pulse, of meter, of subdivisions, etc. So how we rhythmically phrase and how we use accent and dissonance will make the difference of styles. So what is rhythm? Isn't it the roots or connection to the ground? the heartbeat of music or body connection with music? It's probably not just mathematics, right? So, I think rhythm is certainly something we need to experience in our body. And it's why I've chosen to propose a workshop in Porto. Instead of a speech, using our feet, our hands, our voice, the space and gravity at first as I do in my weekly rhythm classes. The purpose then is to build and develop an internal clock, a mental image, the inner ear, physical sensations. And so the principle is, once the rhythm is incorporated in our body and heard mentally, we will then apply on the instrument something that's already there. We'll see how there are logical steps to solve any rhythm situations. As one could say, who clearly conceives it, easily states it. Then, we'll see how to transpose this to the instrument playing. I make a little parenthesis here. Let's be aware that if there are rhythm statements similar for all musicians, there are specific problems to string instrument playing because of the tone production 
with the bow and the slight physical delay it induces. This is a very complicated issue I've been researching and wrote articles about. But I hope you'll forgive me to pass all that theoretical chapter here, not to be too long. So in the workshop, I propose also some concrete examples from the common repertoire, Vivaldi, Bach, Bartok, etc. And I'll be pleased if you have any questions or specific points you'd like us to work on, please join the workshop and bring them as you like. So I really hope we'll meet in the near future. Goodbye and be healthy.